Hello, this is Kat Miller with Blue Iris Learning Center, and I wanted to talk with you today and show you a little bit today in the Energy Circle Creator about how you can edit an existing energy circle and put new or different information, even if you wanted to copy information from one energy circle into another. I had a specific request to to have the information in this energy circle inserted into another energy circle and the picture changed from a sapphire to a an emerald so what i'm going to do is i'm going to flip over into another copy of the energy circle creator and i'm going to open the energy circle that that this person wanted to have information inserted into. So here we have the energy circle. It's the sublime gold is the format, the energy circle that she wanted this put in. Now I'm going to come into the footer and I'm going to bring information from this first energy circle over into that one. So, excuse me, we just come here and copy this information. I'm not going to actually take the information on blue sapphire there. I'm just going to bring the original information because we are going to replace the information on blue sapphire with emerald. So, now I can take this and I can make the text all pretty and match what's already here by just applying the same information to this as what I have already in the footer. And there we have that. It's changed to match that that's already here in the footer. And I'm going to make it bold uh, on the titles just because that's, that's the way I like to have my titles is looking pretty and bold. And this, some of the information in this came from Niran Bala Kumar. I believe I pronounced that right. If I didn't, I'm sorry, Niran. Anyway, so here we have this information and we want to add to it some additional information. I want to go into the switch words, or excuse me, the uh, numbers database and find information about emerald because we want to have an emerald instead of a blue sapphire there and i like this information here on this first entry so i'm going to take this homeopathic vibration rate that we have here for the emerald and i'm going to pull it over into here and i'm going to take the phrase that we have here and I'm going to put it into the energy circle and I'm going to have it at the bottom and the other one that's in the other energy circle at the top I want to come and pull this information now that's in this energy circle and so I'm going to I don't want this lower because this lower one is about um, the sapphire and the number in here is about sapphire. I really only want the uh, first switch phrase brought into it. So we've got that now. And of course, if we want to have things a different color, I'm thinking that perhaps we want to go with green since we're dealing with emerald. And so I'm going to go ahead and change the color of the text here to green. And I'm going to apply that. And now we have, as you can see back there, it's green. I'm just going to say, okay, I'm happy with that. Now I want to look at the footer again because I just brought over the number for the emerald. And so here is the number for the emerald. Oops. And I'm going to bring that up to the top too. Excuse me. I'm going to pull that. So we've got that coming up to the top. And we really want, I really want to have everything be the green. So I'm just going to go back and make 
get all green again here. And perhaps I will uh, make it bold and italic. I like that. I like a little bit of a heavy hand in the energy circles. And so now I'm kind of getting there. It's starting to look more like what I want. If we flip into this other screen and and we look at what we have here, we can kind of follow that format with what we're doing here. We also want to add this inner image, an emerald, instead of the sapphire. So there we have uh, the image. Now I want to go into the text box, and you can click over here on edit text box, or you can hit, as you can see, the X is underlined there. You can hit Alt X if you would prefer. Now let me see. We're starting pretty close to where I want to start inside the energy circle. Um, but maybe I want to go up just a little bit higher. And that might be a little bit too high for me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to I play around a little bit to make it so that it's really easy to adjust in small increments. I'm going to make these all... Uh, these lines above where the text starts, six, uh, size 6. And that allows me to add very minute spacing to text as I'm bringing it into where I want it. And that looks like that's about where I'm going to want it because what I want to do is I want to make insert a line feed right here. So now we have that setting just where we want it to. And we want to bring the number for the sapphire up to the top. And so when I look, we've got it in a good place now. And so now I want to bring this one down below. And it's just right. This switch phrase is just placed right exactly where we want it, it looks like to me. So I'm going to do that. And there we have it. We have just shifted into a new energy circle what it was that we had in the old one and uh, made that we, we brought the information we wanted quickly and easily into this new energy circle and we have left behind what we didn't want. We now have two separate energy circles that have similar information. These are, uh, by the way, about um, dental, uh, help with dental treatment is what the energy circle uh, is all about. So there we have it, just a really quick editorial or informational uh, video here for you about working with the energy circle creator to take something that you already have, such as this, and creating something new with it. So I trust this will be information that you will find helpful. Learn more about uh, the Energy Circle Creator at ecc.blueiris.org.